Welcome to our course Design of Transmission System. Today we are going to discuss one problem on the design of V-Pel tri using manufacturer catalog. Here we are going to use the PSC design data book for our reference. The problem is given. Here we have to write the given data for our particular problem. The application is centrifugal pump. The input is motor. Right? Here we are going to write the given data as the speed of driven pulley N2 is 340 rpm. Power transmitted B is 100 kilowatt. Speed of driving pulley N1 is 1440 rpm. And the center distance C is given as 1000 200 millimeter and service is 20 hours a day. Based on these things, we are going to draw roughly this particular V pelt drive diagram. Here, this is the motor, and this the larger pulley is the a centrifugal pump. Here the small d is I taken as diameter of driving pulley and n1 is speed of driving pulley. It is given d is not provided. Uh, for centrifugal pump capital D is diameter of larger pulley n2 is given as 340 rpm. Based on these two speed ratios uh, given speed we can able to calculate i n1 by n2 is equal to 4.23. Now, we move to the step-by-step -step method for solving this particular problem using design data book. Step number one, pelt selection. So, refer the data book page number 7.58. For 100 kilowatt power, the T section pelt is selected. Recommended for this particular pelt, we make note all these four parameters. Minimum pulley diameter is three. D 355 millimeter nominal top width is 32 millimeter nominal thickness is 19 millimeter and weight per meter is 0.596 kilogram force. Now we move to the second step. This is the step number two. We can calculate the pulley diameters. Now refer the page number 7.61. The diameter of larger pulley is given as capital D is small d into n1 by n2 into efficiency. Here we can assume the efficiency as 0.92. So now substitute these values 355 into 1440 by 340 into 0.98. We can get uh, the value as 1473.45 millimeter. From data book page number 7.54 next standard pulley diameter we can take an as capital D as 1600 millimeter. Now we move to the step number 3 the central distance. In the problem itself the C value is directly given so you can take C as 1200 millimeter it is uh, given if the C value is not given we have to go to the page number 7.61 we can take this ratio C by D equal to some ratio based on I we have to calculate the center distance Step number 4, nominal pitch length. From the data book 7.61, we have to use this formula L equal to 2C plus 5 by 2 into uh, capital D plus small d plus D minus T whole squared by 4C. Substitute all these values, we can get the value as 5792.27 millimeter. From data book, page number 7.60, for the T cross section V pelt, the next Standard nominal pitch length available is 6124 millimeter. Next step is calculation of maximum power transmitting capacity in kilowatt. From data book page number 7.62 for D cross section formula available is K W is equal to 3.22 S power minus 0 0.09 minus 506.7 by T sub X E minus 4.78 into 10 power minus 4 multiplied by S square whole multiplied by S where velocity of the pelt is S. S equal to by D N1 by 60 into 1000. Substitute the values we can get as 26.77 meter per second. The equivalent pitch diameters T sub X E is equal to Tp into Fv. 
diameter of minimum pulley is 355 f is we are going to calculating by the formula that is small diameter factor by d by d that is 1600 by 355 4.51 from theta book 7.62 for this d by d ratio we can take f c f b is 1.14 for the values of 2.94 and over right now substitute these two values 355 into 1.14 multiplying we can get the equivalent diameter as 404.7 4 millimeter now substitute all the values in this equation the kilowatt is equal to 3.22 into 26.77 to the power of minus 0 0.09 minus 506.7 by 404.7 minus 4.78 into 10 power minus 4 multiplied by 26.77 whole square whole multiplied by 26.77 we get the value of 21.435 kilowatt this is the maximum power transmitting capacity of single pelt now we move to the step number six now we are going to calculate number of welds from the data book page number 7.770 number of wealth is equal to P into FA by K W into FC and FD. Here we need to calculate these factor values where F sub X A is nothing but the service factor or load correction factor. We can take in from the data book 7.70 the value is 1.3 for centrifugal pump over 16 hours of service right then f sub c is nothing but length correction factor this value is taken as 1 from the data book 7.60 right for our selected d section belt and fd is correction factor for arc of contact we know the formula from theta book 7.68 theta is equal to 180 minus 60 into d minus t by c substitute the values we will get the theta value as 117.75 now from the theta book same data book now we can check this value for b v drive we can take for 117.75 we can get the values 0.781 we need to substitute all the values in this particular formula right we can get the number of felt as 7.487 we will take in as the round number as 8 felt for this particular application now we move to the next and final step step number 7 axial center distance calculations here from the data book 7.61 we have this formula c is equal to a plus square root of a square minus b where capital a is l by 4 minus pi into t plus t by 8 substitute the value we can get this number 763.27 similarly b value is t minus d whole squared by 8 this value we will get we substitute all these values here then we can get c value as 1386.83 millimeter for our b felt uh, design we like to include the or consider the initial tension here the one percentage of length is we have to reduce then we can give the initial tension so the final center distance is nothing but 99 percentage of length is considered so 0 0.99 into 1386 we can get the final length as 1372.96 millimeter so this is the way we can design the design of v pelt using manufacturer yet law thanks for watching my video thank you